and welcome back to my channel. So today's video I am doing my beauty and fashion monthly favorites for February. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and get started. And uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump in. So the first thing I want to talk about is makeup. Now, I'm not going to lie, I have not worn a lot of makeup for the past two months just because I've been breaking out and my skin has been really, really dry. Um, but now that the weather is warming up and wanting to just all of a sudden really change to a freaking heat wave, my skin is starting to get oily. So starting off, I want to talk about my foundation that I've been loving. And this is the L'Oreal Magic Nude Liquid Powder, and I've been really, really loving this. I am in the color Buff Beige, if you are wondering. Um, I will probably have to get like a darker color because I do get tan during the summertime and stuff like that. Just being outside, I don't do the tanning bed things, which is not for me. And I'm naturally dark anyways because I am Indian, so yeah. I really love this. It's a, a goes on liquid and it finishes as a powder. It's awesome. I only have to blot one time during this whole entire day. It's amazing. I love this. Um, I can't go any more wrong. The only thing I kind of wish it had was a pump instead of a, like a, a top like this. Just because of germs and stuff like that, I'm really not a big fan of that. So I really wish that it had a pump instead of that. So. The next thing I'm talking about is my eyeshadows. I haven't re been really going crazy with my eyeshadows. Um, just the nude, neutral eyes. And that's about it for my eyeshadows. I've been using the Comfort Zone Wet n Wild palette here. And uh, these are the two colors that I've been using. Nothing too fancy, just something light on my eyes. Eyeliner, mascara, and go out the door. Um, the next color that I like to use also over my eyes if I want something more, you know, different and stuff like that is the Inflammable 24 Hour Loose Eyeshadow Pigment in the color Ice Latte. I absolutely love this. It's amazing. Can't go wrong with this. The only downside I don't really like is I have to use my finger because I feel like my finger can use, use my finger a lot better and you get like more products on your finger than a brush. So. I don't know. Um, the next thing is lipsticks, and I have swatches on my hands to actually show you what my lipsticks look like. Um, I have been only been using these two lipsticks because I feel like it's still around winter time, and it's almost springtime, so I will be bringing out like the hot pinks and the reds and the you know all that good stuff. But um, as of right now, I'm still rocking the fall colors, and this one is actually the Sugar Plum one in um, the Revlon Lip Butter, this one right here. Um, yeah, so I really like these. I love how moisturizing they are, and yeah, they stay on. I only have to reply it like one time during my whole, if I'm out doing something and stuff like that, that's the only time I have to really apply it. Um, this one is actually NYC, and it's very, very messy because my daughter got a hold of it, and, uh, it was a very awful mess to clean up, but it's okay. It's okay. I still love her. <laughs> but, um, this is actually the color Share Red in NYC. Um, like I said, she made a mess with it. I still love this color, and it still works perfectly fine. And that's the color right here. But um, it was so funny whenever she applied that all over her face. It was it was like the biggest mess to clean up. But I could not stop laughing and I could not stay mad at her because it was just so funny. It was so cute. Um, the next thing I want to talk about is mascaras. And this is actually my two favorite mascaras that I have been using. I really love the Rocket, but... With these two combos, I feel like my eyelashes is like, psh, and my daughter has beautiful eyelashes, and oh my gosh, she's just not going to have to wear makeup whenever she gets older, because she's just naturally beautiful. Um, my concealer I've been using is actually the Glamouflage Concealer, and I am in the color Ultra Light. I got an Ultra Light just because um, I wanted to get a light color to cover my bags under my eyes, and um, yeah, so... That is all my makeup products that I've been loving for the month of February. Like I said, it's not a lot, 
but I really haven't been wearing a lot of makeup to really, you know, have a lot of products to show. So next, we're moving on to hair care. And uh, these are my shampoo and conditioners that I've been loving. This is the L'Oreal Total Repairs Restoring Shampoo. And it has been doing so much wonder to my hair. I have noticed less breakage on my hair. I feel like my hair is more shinier. Um, just amazing feeling. And it feels a lot healthier, especially because I did dye my hair. You can't really tell. Oh, maybe you can't. I don't know. Um, but my hair color is burgundy because I dyed it to burgundy and I will be dyeing it again here pretty soon before our trip so um, my conditioner I've been using is the um, anti-breakage keratin oil conditioner and it says it shot makes your hair shine and strengthens um, and nourished throughout for longer and strongest hair or stronger hair I should say the next thing is my hairspray. I love this hairspray to death. This is the Big Sexy Hairspray, and I love it. Um, it doesn't really make my hair like, I don't know, I feel like I can still, if I curl my hair, I feel like I can still, you know, move it and stuff like that. Um, it's not like thick, but also, um, as you can see right here, I do have like some strand right here. I sprayed some right there, and um, it does still, you know, stay in place but I still feel like I can move it around so I really love this I love the smell it's amazing the thing I've also been using is my curling wand and my sister-in-law got this for me and I'm not 100% sure where it's from or what it's called she said that she used it one time and um, she just really didn't like it but it works great for my hair she said it gets too hot for her hair and um, I will be using curling wands during the summer just because I love the curls that it gives to my hair. And um, yeah, so I'm not 100% sure what brand this is. I think it's called Royal or something. I'm not 100% sure, but um, yeah. So it's just a regular old curling wand. My fragrance for February, and this is probably going to be my springtime favorite fragrance, is the Pink with the Splash Fresh and Fierce. And as you can tell from like the inside, it smells like springtime. It's like floral, fresh scent. It's just, it smells so good and it reminds me of springtime. So I really love this. The next thing on the fashion related things, I have been wearing scarves, but um, just here's just a scarf that I'm just going to show you. I've been wearing a lot of scarves um, because the first beginning of um, February. It was really cold still and now this week at the end of February it's starting to be in the 70s. So yeah, I don't need this but I have been wearing this for the month of February. Um, along with fashion and stuff like that, I have been wearing my new tennis shoes which these will be in a haul um, that's coming up. These are actually for my trip that I'm taking in April. Um, I will be taking these on my trip with us because we will be doing a lot of walking. Um, so yeah, these are my shoes that I have been wearing for the month of February as well. These are my Christmas presents that I got and, and these are my riding boots. And they are black. They were from Target. I got them from Target for Christmas. I absolutely love them. They are the most comfortable thing ever, and they go along with everything. So I have been really loving those. Um, that is actually all of my haul, or not my haul, but my monthly favorites for February. I hope you guys enjoy, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!